something that I've been learning lately is if you are participating in the creative process, especially if that creative process like filmmaking takes up a lot of time and has a lot of steps in it, it's very, very easy to procrastinate. Basically, the more steps that you have towards doing the thing, the more opportunities you have to say that maybe uh, this thing isn't worth doing at all. The longer that creative process is, the more opportunity you have to doubt. So I haven't made things very often for a lot of reasons. For one, I am a perfectionist, which sucks. So I overanalyze things way before I get to the point where I'm actually starting to make them. So a lot of ideas are killed in the idea process, really, which sucks. So I've taken things into my own hands a little bit, and I've decided to start shooting things without a script. And to start shooting things, even though I have no idea what the thing that I'm making even is, I just trust that I'll figure out things uh, as I go along, which is has been extremely liberating, and it's actually uh, helped me a lot, you know, get to the point where uh, I am making things more regularly, like all the time, actually, and that's been really fun. I've had a, a fantastic time with that, and well, that leads me to this shot. Uh, me in the bathtub. You see, um, this video, the whole idea behind it was I was going to make a video without a plan. Essentially in the style that I've been trying to communicate for the last couple minutes. And the way I was going to do that was by one, using a bit of suspense, building up some tension... Uh, and by two, telling the story and conveying the message of just make something without thinking too hard about it through a monologue where I am in this tub. So that brings us to this tub, this shot of me in the tub. And this film, if you can even call it that, didn't turn out very well. I actually never finished it and I didn't plan on using it for anything that is until i decided to make this video that you're watching right now and um well that footage wasn't a waste of time even though it was technically a failure now it was a failure for a, a few different reasons i i got kind of caught up in the weeds of the idea a little bit so i i wanted it to uh, to be about like the process of creating something without uh, a plan but i also wanted to like shoot it in that way but i didn't have that like fleshed out as well while i was doing it so i ended up just i ended up just monologuing not really knowing what i was supposed to be like saying and what information i was supposed to be getting across um and now ironically that footage is being used to convey the very message that I intended to communicate all along through the video that you're watching. So you're watching a video of a failed video, both of which are in the style of the message that I'm trying to communicate, which is to make something without a plan and to just kickstart that creative process. Because if you're a perfectionist like me, let me tell you, you will give yourself every reason to not make something. So that's it. That's, that is the video. I hope that was useful and not too rambly. Gosh, I hope it wasn't too rambly. Yeah.